Hello, guys. So, mm, talking about dumb things or things that our parents used to say to us as kids to stop us doing dumb things. And it, <laughs> this has got to be the cutest and funniest thing ever. So, as kids, tend to uh, stick your fingers in places where you yeah, it's pretty grim really, let's be frank with it either up your nose or yeah, anywhere else oh, it's a hole, stick my finger in it so <laughs> story is it's a little kid would continually stick his finger into his belly button hole and just sit there playing away with his finger in his belly button hole and he would get sore and it would, you know I wouldn't say it was bleeding or anything like that but he'd just get sore and it would hurt and he complained to his parents and the reply was if you keep playing with your belly button your butt will fall off and you just imagine the look on the kid's face it's just like <gasps> Oh my god, if I keep playing with my belly button, my butt will fall off. And that is just the funny, the cutest thing ever or what? <laughs> you just imagine the kid like, oh, I better stop, my ass will fall off. So another thing as well that when I used to get told is, I say you stuff and think about picking my nose. I think it was just involuntary, you know, you'd sit in front of watching the TV or something like that as a kid or or reading a comics or reading a book or just doing anything in particular and your mind would wonder and so would your finger and mine generally wandered up my nose. So I'd be sat there with my finger up my nose and I remember being told if you continue to pick your nose you'll scratch your brain and turn dumb. <laughs> Is that just the best thing ever? The dumb things that we tell kids and they believe it as well. And I think I was like, oh my God, I better stop picking my nose because I'm gonna turn dumb. Guess what, it didn't work. I still pick my nose and I'm still really dumb. Anyway, till the next time, ta-ta.